Hello, I'm Ethan Winters. Welcome to Jackass. Welcome back to Cloud9 Plays Resident Evil 7 Extra Content in the minigames menu. We are about to embark on a very special adventure today. The extra game known as Ethan Must Die. Hello, Ethan, my old friend. It's time for you to die again. This has been Cloud9's rendition of A Sound of Silence by Simon and Garfunkel. For now, we say cheers to you. Thanks to Arizona Premium Spike Beverage, the original hard, real-brewed green tea with ginseng flavor and honey. 5% alcohol by volume. So cheers to you all, and cheers to those who tried. Cheers to the losers who have had enough of losing and are ready for the sweet taste of victory. Cheers, everybody. Hmm. I told my partner, Mr. Gerdad, in private that this will be my attempt at the game in which I actually reach the greenhouse. All right, now it's time for Ethan Must Die once again, where fortunes change and you may leave deranged. Is there an item over here? Dang. Well, all right, the game is really jipping me with the items right now. Uh, no, no, you will have to eventually come back out over here. And because it is so damn dangerous, well, I might have time to get this. All right, I got a handgun. Owie. Okay. Burner is in my grass. Let's pull out the shoddy, knock him back, and then finish him using said shoddy burner. Beating also Fatty's attacks. I may have just eliminated both of them. Fatty is above my head, but he- Whoa! Wow. I was not ready for that. Dang. That was looking pretty good, too. Let's have another drink. Discretion is the better part of valor. This is insane. Nobody could get through this. We've all felt that way, bro. And there's a statue waiting for me in a place I might be able to retrieve it. I'm gonna take a drink before I go into the living room and risk dying. Oh, I hear- I, I just gained a little lesson just now, is uh, I'm going to not go over there, and the game is nice enough to just not even bother putting an item over there this time. How about I try getting this one? Uh, handgun time. A uh, block. Don't bite me! Ah! I learned some things. With every lesson, I become more powerful. Fucking angel! Oh, full ammo, nice. Well, golly gee willikers, if only I, uh, you know, felt like it. I'm about to get killed, yep. <laughs> I don't know how he caught me. I'm gonna run for my goddamn life while I hope that I get something better and also not get puked on by giant zombie fat bastards. Do I go up the stairs? Nope. No, that didn't work hard. Oh, yep, yep, I'm stuck. All right, retry. <laughs> no, no, don't tell on Rody. Don't tell on Rody that Ethan just retried the game. I, I did let him. I, I attacked one too many times. It, it's okay. It's okay. Learn from your mistakes. <laughs> yeah. Isn't it amazing how video games can just teach you a, a general truth about life? Is learn. Be open to learning. Don't presume that failure is inevitable because you're mind because you're you're a mindless creature. You are paying attention. You are getting lessons along the way, and you're all the better off for these lessons. That's the whole fucking point of this mini game. Ethan Must Learn is really the name of this game, and uh, the vomit spray almost got me that time. To not get zombie bit from the zombie piece of shit is gonna get blocked by me closing that door, giving me a time to examine the prospect, which is before me. Not getting snuck up on either, because the door was closed, and so too was the gateway to my pants. Honestly, now that I realize this method for actually setting up the run, finally it gives me an, a chance to, like, you know, cool off a bit. Because I, I admit that th this game can be rather frustrating. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, if y this if you've been watching the Cloud9 Play show, I, I do have a temper. I do get emotional. I do clip my microphone and scream to the point that people don't even want to watch, not even myself. What I aim to prove here is that emotion is just another obstacle. You must learn to overcome yourself. Uh, that, uh, is gonna help me kill somebody. Okay, so now he's out of the- I think he's out of the way. Oh, machine gun, nice. 
Uh, that, that bomb trap took out two enemies. There's no one else near me right now. All of the items in this minigame come from these little boxes. Which means you have to take a little time to make sure that has the correct amount of tape on it, because if it doesn't, you're going down. Okay, he missed, but he may try doing a quick bite to take me out. Christ, yeah, I knew, I knew he was gonna do the quick bite. Okay, that, that one didn't count, that one didn't count. Oh, I just heard somebody spawn, but I happen to know that as long as I keep on keeping on, this guy's not going to be able to reach me in time, because there's a reason why it takes me only so many strikes! I'm still alive! I am still alive, motherfucker! Yeah! And thankfully, the nerve gas trap is not so fast that it's going to cause that to happen. Uh, I guess, I guess I should have waited a second. Slash, 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 run through, and then instead of engaging him any further, just shut the door on him. And he's trying to break it open there. Can he? Nah. That yeah, sucks to be you, bro. I, I actually forgot that was a thing in this game, that they'll just start banging on the door like that. They're that stupid. They can't get through. They can invade every wall space of your cellular structure, but they can't get through a fucking door? <laughs> is it? Is this? My my god. I, after, after all this time, I think I'm... I think I... I, I may be having fun. I, th I think I'm actually having fun. Oh boy! The waiting certainly is the hardest part while going through this game repeatedly. That if you screw up badly enough that you will have to see this shit over and over and over again walking through corridors. Where the fuck? Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, you gotta go through the door this- Oh, Jesus! <laughs> More like it. Yeah. Uh, level 2 item, level 2 item, but is the correct amount of tape on it? No, no, that's- that's a trap. See, watch, I'm gonna shoot it open, it's a trap. Yeah, yeah, I remember. I remember this. Oh, this fucking game and the amount of time I spent dying on it. Oh, yeah. You have to die. You would have to be crazy not to expect to die. Go down. Whoa. Okay, that. Oh, right. You actually have to guard. Yeah, right, right. No nasty surprises yet. Like getting fucked. And Mr. Winters don't want to be fucked by anybody except Mrs. Winters. I got a good feeling about this run. If there's one thing that will make life a little easier for people playing this game, it's good feelings. I got a good feeling about having a little beer, a carbonated beverage, making you burp and such. No items over here. Let's see, uh... Oh yeah, here's a guy who probably should not have indulged so much in all that whatever the fuck he had to make him go that badly. Hello there, sir. How you doing, Oogie Boogie? Come on. All right, come on. W would you get your fat ass over here? Open up, this is the police. Oh, shit. Uh, we'll come back for a warrant with your arrest. All right, and remember to use use the pillar of faith. Ow. Well, that wasn't supposed to happen. All right, just use this pillar as your protection. He's doing plague zombie routine. Uh, I get to sneak around. I'm going down. Yep. Come on. Oh, he's doing Plague Zombie now. Interesting. It's gonna put you over here by the pillar. I think I have a chance- Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can't believe I actually did not get sprayed with vomit right there. That is amazing. Either could use a little exercise. Chris said as early as his military training that Ethan's gonna need a little more meat on his bones, a little more hair on his balls. Yeah. Take that. Does it make you feel good? It's probably the reason why they left it there. Uh, I guess, uh, yeah, just try it. Just give it a shot, man. Oh, right. Yeah. <laughs> I remember this. I fucking remember this. You you have to disarm the bomb from the other side. Uh, pick up the burner, because it fits. And just get ready to retreat in order for these wire traps to take out shoulder pads around the corner here. My buddy's shoulder pad. I remember you. you you're supposed to come in. Yeah, come in. Yeah. You can't escape me. I'm a zombie. I am a relentless pursuer combined with a crab monster. My crustaceous appendage will make short work of you, Ethan Winters. I'm going to lure you out a bit. I'm going to take a sip. Let's run all the way to the end and be safe and wait for the second boom. Interesting. Yes, quite. Let's take a sip. 
This tripwire is brought to you by Blue Moon Light Sky. Oh, I love this hall. You know why? Because it's drinking time. I can take a drink because all I got to do is wait for the traps to work this guy over. Here we go. Follow me now. Follow me. That's good. That's good. Mm. Oh, you have to be kidding me right now. Can a man have a fucking drink in peace? I wonder if somebody scripted the spawn over here now that I did that. I don't hear anything. <laughs> and something goes a bump in the night. Remember that tripwire bomb down the stairs there, because a lot has happened. You know, it only takes three seconds to forget something, and in that three seconds, you walk into that fucking bomb because you forgot it was still there. <laughs> Are there even any items? Oh my god, there are no items over here. Damn it. Um, okay, well, that's actually gonna save me a lot of time. That's that among the many attempts that I've had at this that's the first time that there was there was literally no point in going over there And I know because I have x-ray glasses in my inventory Um, and there are no items in here either damn this game's getting brutal with the luck right now Hopefully my luck will improve as I go through the dungeon. Here we go Hey, mr. Tripwire bomb might not be very nice of you to take advantage of somebody who had forgotten a lot of things What the fuck? Oh, Jesus Oh, God. What is happening? Yeah, get your magnum out. There's a four-legged... Okay, somebody got hit by the nerve gas trap. You have to kill all... Now I remember. There there are rooms There are rooms that do this. You have to kill all the enemies before you can... Make, get, get, get the hell away from me, you. You can just stay and lay dead. The room door's been unlocked. It's, it's supposed to make you shit your pants. And you know what? It did. <laughs> it made me shit my fucking pants. <laughs> Where's the guy again? Oh, there he is. I should not have tried detonating it that close to me. I mean, it did hit the zombie, but I did not survive the explosion. Hmm. I have gunpowder over here. Sounds sexy. I feel like concocting something fun. I'm gonna take some drugs. Now that I'm high on drugs, I can see the world for what it is. I'm gonna pop open the strong chem fluid with my pants. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, come on, show me it. You son of a bitch! Ah! Wow. Hello, some bitch. Goodbye, some bitch. <sighs> Maybe I should wait to get the reload upgrade so it feels like it matters. <laughs> and drinking time. Oh, there's time, there's time to drink, there's time to not drink. Take a sip. What the f oh my god, that fucking sound bite. That, that sound bite is in like every game mode where you can go into this room right here. It's supposed to scare the fucking hell out of you, and you know what? It did. This reminds me quite a bit of... Sends Fortress from Dark Souls. This whole minigame is basically the run-up to the Iron Golem fight. Honestly, I would rather play this than do Sends Fortress. <laughs> this is not that bad. It's very fun at times, too. The game is designed to get you to laugh. Dark Souls, I don't know what the fuck they were going for when they invented Dark Souls after Demon Souls. Now time for everybody's favorite backup. The Leap of Faith. Backs to the wall. Oh, boy. It's amazing how you only have just enough time to run for your goddamn life. First, I was afraid. I was petrified. Thinking how I could never ever survive. But then I spent so many tries learning where I had gone wrong and I got strong. Cause so many times I was wrong and now I'm back. Done. Done. Dun, 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 dun. Damn, too early. Yeah, <laughs> you're fun to run away from. Hey, it is a more powerful handgun. I'm gonna use this more powerful handgun, and I'm gonna destroy things with it. Close the door again, and let's drink. Fuck it, man. I'm gonna go get another beer. Ah, the sweet sound of safety. Gunshot time. Guns across the door. That is Jack. He's dead on the floor. 
This is my knife. Here to save my life. I hope soon I'll find my wife. Um, is there another machine gun like at the end of this corridor over here? No. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Ah! Damn it. <laughs> Whoops. Hey, those, those machine guns can really detect you from a distance. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, come on. What do you got? What do you got? Are you going to try to hit me over there? What the? Really? Oh, the machine gun hit the explosive. Well, well, that sucks. Okay, and run through this door. Re really? Just really? I missed? Hey. Oh, jeez. Oh, boy. No! <laughs> oh, my God. The mirror is broken. The, somebody smashed the mirror out of anger. And this is Grandma's room. That is fantastic attention to detail. Go, 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 go! Jesus! Ah, oh, the nerves. They're trying to kill me. They're trying to kill us all. I don't think two-star items carry those, per se. I am at full health. Don't need the strong first aid cam. Kind of wish I had steroids at this point, but I don't. Let's check in the bathroom. This this is the this is the last stop because I can't I I'm not about to go back for that handgun ammo if I can't if I can't upgrade my handgun. Another strong first aid med. Are you are you fucking me right now? <laughs> These there are three Randomization, everybody. This is... If you are not convinced that this is a randomized game, let that be proof. There are three strong first aid meds on this floor. Hey, keep up the fight. That's okay. That's okay. That is not as okay. Do I get rid of the survival knife and just depend on the burner in order to break open items is a thing. Because Ethan can't fucking kick in this game. It's the point that they introduce in Resident Evil Village that he gets some combat training, basically, so he can finally kick things, because he knows how to kick correctly. Mm. Uh, oh, man, I cannot leave this item behind. Bro. Oh, the dilemmas. It's part of the thing that I love about this game, also, is you spend, like, fucking two minutes uh, basing a decision on sound reasoning, inventory management, and full utilization of your available resources, and then five seconds later, you're just dead because you stupidly, like, aim too far to the right or something. Quick decision. Jump down. Run away. Get the hell away. Uh, did it again? What? Oh, 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 oh. Um. Did, did it, did it, did it work? Oh, uh, oh, he's, he's not dead. He's not dead. He is definitely not dead. You son of a bitch, you. Next time, when the bomb goes off, just stay dead. Oh, boy. I thought I, I thought I, uh, was a little too close to the side there. Oh, <laughs> what fun. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What, what was, what the fuck was that all about? What just happened? How did that trap go off? <laughs> Okay, and in, in, in any case, it would be mighty unfortunate at this point if this guy if this guy decided that this was the run he was going to come down and royally fuck me up, like scare the piss out of me. I'm just hoping that when I go in, when I go into the garage to see if there are items that that guy is not just going to spawn. So being that being a possibility, I'm going to keep my hands handgun ammo out. The I think he's just going to stay away. That's that's a bomb. Yeah, that's... Yeah, I can, I can hear it ticking. It's it's a bomb. Uh, is that a bomb? Oh, it, it is ticking, alright. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a bomb. Psycho stems. There's a four-star item in there. And there's a bomb trap. Whoa! Where the fuck did you come from? I don't remember this room that well. Yeah. I don't see any lines, unless there's a- uh, there may be a trap- What the fuck? I definitely don't remember that. Alright, oh, he doesn't have any arms. <laughs> so that's the fucking point of this room, is yeah, you think you're in the clear? Psych. No, you're not. Open up the chest, wait for the dude to spawn, here he is. He's gonna dodge to the right first, no? 
Oh, cool. One hit death. That works for me, too. Stay dead. Be dead. Be the best dead you can be. Drop the excess ammo, because there is something important here. I'm not, they, they better not just give me back the walking shoes. I, why the walking shoes are a four-star item, I think that is just designed to fuck with... What the fuck? Really? They're just giving it back to me? No. No, screw this. Screw your shoes and screw your kicks. This looks like a trap. Yep, that's a trap. It's ticking. Thank you. You know, it's it's. what the fuck is the point of it ticking, honestly? Uh, actually, throwers are not waiting for ticking because modern bombs don't tick. Uh, I'm sorry, but but throwers, baggage handlers. Uh, pick up the greenhouse key. Leave this item alone. Let's see what's inside it. It Did it really just give me back the MPM handgun? You fucking randomizer. You're not so random. You're waiting for me to do things first. Okay, get the greenhouse key. Sets the conditions for the trap. Try escaping now. Go on, you got the key. Go to the greenhouse. You already got on the home stretch. <laughs> you stupid bastard. We got you. All right, good. Oh. Don't shoot at me, you bastard. Come on, take him out. Show us the meaning of haste. Show us the meaning of in your face. Whoa. What? Okay. What do you got, Mr. Shoulder Pads? Who's your daddy? Me, baby. All right, there goes all the traps. There goes all the crawlers. They normally don't put new spawn triggers right next to the other ones. Holy shit. Uh, machine gun time. Okay. No, no, real time, real time. Oh, wow. All those steroids, and I still didn't have enough health to survive the four-legged molded. Well, darn. Game over. We're not out of the woods yet. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I missed. Huh, run. Huh. Oh, Jesus. Uh, use these bombs now. I don't believe this. I got these bastards. All right, here we go. All right, he missed. Nice. Oh. 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 My pants. My pants are th thoroughly soiled. Okay, unlock the door. Cool. Oh. Oh. Oh, 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 okay, okay, game, okay, you just made me shit my pants, that would have ended my run right there. <sighs> the problem is, I can't, I can't fucking go in here, because if I do, yeah. um, unless that item right there can help me survive, um, maybe there's an item in the laundry room, with my super x-ray glasses, I could determine if it's even worth it for me to come down this way in the first place. Uh, there is an item in there. Okay, I'm gonna go for it. Really? But Wait a second. I think that's always supposed to be a trap on the other side. That's why it's there. Yeah. I am completely out of ammo. Take me. The guys don't start spawning until Fatso gets aggroed. Huh, <laughs> that rhymed. Okay, well, I'm gonna try aggroing Fatso, then. Because what the fuck at this point? Yep. Wait a minute. I- 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 I must have gotten slashed in order for that to happen. Hmm. Okay, nice. That was a spontaneous headshot. Okay. No more skinny zombies. Either that or I miscounted. Okay. No more skinny zombies. So, all you have to do now is just figure out how to deal with Fatso. Whoa, whoa, whoa! whoa. What the fuck? Uh, so what? It's four skinny zombies and two four and two four leggeds, huh? They definitely want me to use the wire traps set on the greenhouse door in order to take out Fatso. Or just get him out of the way. Let's see what happens. Oh, and we're running, 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 running. Running, running, running. Running, running, running. Ah, uh, okay, that didn't work. 
I'm gonna see if I can just fucking run past Fatty. It's it's the only option I have. I don't have any ammo. All my all my weapons are dead. There are no tripwire traps over here. Uh, Fatty, please move out of the way. Please. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I, I made it. I actually fucking made it this time. I gotta get to the door. They're following me. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Open this fucking door right now. Open it. Uh, oh. Now close the door. Oh! Oh my god. I made it to the greenhouse. I actually made it to the fucking greenhouse. Oh my god. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Do or die time. Uh, there's another trip. The trip bar bomb right there. <laughs> there are trip bar bombs everywhere. Don't open any doors for the love of God. Don't just don't do it. It's a bad idea. Just don't do it. Okay, that's that's uh, you you know you know what's coming. She's gonna break over. She's gonna break down that window. Keep the keep the gun out. Okay, and go. Yeah. You bitch. Where is she? Oh, she's over here. Oh, no, 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 don't, 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 come on. D Ethan? Okay, heal, heal, keep her in the path of the gun, so maybe the gun will hit her. Whoa. I am out of healing items, and I'm dead. Oh, well. Oh, my, God. wait, it's, it's out of ammo? Okay, well, good, now I can stop fucking hitting me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I am dead. I might be dead. Oh, come on, Ethan. Really? You couldn't take just one more shot? The grave will out the truth. Here's a toast to myself. Playing as Ethan Winters, a drama a uh, fictional character that is being piloted by a very real flesh and blood, somewhat easily frustrated human. We will see where this draft takes us this evening as we restart from the beginning. Cheers.